Today I'm just waiting for a delivery and also people sorting out the gas meter and stuff so I'm not sure really what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna tidy a bit I think with a bath I'm, I'm sure it's like curbside delivery so hopefully if I act innocent I'll like bring it to the hall I'm just gonna clean I think nothing else to do here the delivery is eight till five. Oh god fingers crossed they'll be here soon let's go tidy so i just swatched the blake morale color from valspa and this is it just drying now so i'll put it up against the fireplace once it's dried but obviously there's shadow on it but yeah i think it's gonna look really nice against the fireplace So the only cleaning products I have is a wipe, <laughs> but can anyone help? This is like slate, yeah it's slate, and this is damaged. Does anyone have any tips on how to repair it? I'm not sure, but yeah it's all nice and clean. On the top now I'm gonna do the bottom now okay so I've done what I can on that this is like the dumping ground so what I want to do is I want to try and cover these with something so I'm gonna because they get really dusty so I'm wanting to clear all of this and then get rid of the dust and then I'll cover it up with something these have been my best friend since owning this house. 80 wipes and I've still got a load left. And after just being here, oh my god, I don't know if you can see that. The amount of dust is awful. So I just wipe my hands with these and they smell lovely. It's pomegranate and lime splash. So I'm going to put gloves on now because I can't be asked doing this again. So clean them and then put some gloves on. This is the tile I'm going to be using in the kitchen as a backsplash. the sideboard locally um, and it's like a mid-century one but I'm not sure on how to get this back into shape like there's a lot of dents and stuff on it but I will work with it it's going in the dining room uh, the same with this Urkel table um, it's got like Dents and stuff on it, but that yeah, that's extendable. Sorry, excuse the mess. That's extendable. So basically, 
both of these are going in the dining room. All dusted and covered now, and that is still drying over there. So, this place is never gonna get any better, I don't think. All of this on the floor, our bathroom delivery from the other day, a load of rubbish over there, plasterboards. So it's never gonna look tidy and I think after all of this, everything will get dusty again. But anyway, I want to try and fill some holes. So I'm gonna go around the house and do that, I think. And it's actually a lovely day, so I'm gutted, but needs must. So that one's dried now. Um, I prefer it, I think. Oh my God, excuse the mess. Yeah, I prefer it to that one. I find that to be a bit bluey. And this goes well with the green in the marble. Let me know what you think. I'm aiming towards the left one, to be honest. So these are the holes I'm going to be filling. Um, if you watched my previous video, um, you would have seen that they put that up there. That's creepy. I've never done this before, I don't think, so... Um... Yeah, I have to stir it and stuff. Um, oh, it's soaking. Not let it dry, I have to put that back later. So, said stir. I'm just scared the bath people are gonna arrive, or the gas people. Oh my God, what the hell? How are we supposed to stir this? The best I can, I think, and I'll sand it later. Another area over here, one, and then there's this. Oh, you can't see it there. Okay, so I'm gonna do those now. I enjoyed that a bit too much. I was going around looking for other things for me to fill, but I've done what I can. So, done that. There was this there. I've not done that, that was there before. Um, I've done this one, and then just the tiny one there been here since 8 and it's now 11 and the gas person is 20 minutes away thank god but no phone call from the bath people yet so they are supposed to give me a time slot of two hours so i've not had a phone call gas person is here gas guy and the bath won't come till two and it's 12 o'clock now and I've done what I can, so just gonna be bored for two hours. Great. So to keep me entertained, I've done some swatches. This is called Visionary by Valspo. So that's it there. Oh, can you see that? So I tried to paint that, but that's the first coat. Um, yeah, I'm liking that actually. I've done another swatch here because it's darker, just so I can see. Yeah, that's gonna look really good, I think. Yeah, it's a curbside delivery. <laughs> and I'm on my own. Oh my God, this is how far I've gone. Um, a kind man in the street saw me struggling, so he helped me 
he pushed it basically. Oh my god, weak weakness, and hopefully it's not damaged. Um, and I've also got some taps. I'll show you like the baths bathroom stuff when it's open and stuff and with the gate earlier i just started to scrape the old paint off i don't want to go into the street a lot of it did come off but i'm gonna do like a whole metal brush and a, like this chemical thing to get it down and get rid of the rust and then paint it probably but that's another thing i was just doing it because i they don't want to look stupid in the front garden. So that was renovation vlog three. And hopefully you liked that one. A thumbs up and subscribe. Be updated on the renovation. Oh my God, I just, it's taking so long. The skip is coming this weekend. So I will do another tour. Hopefully there will be some improvements with the bathroom and stuff. June is a big month because we are having a kitchen. Oops. Subscribe and like and obviously help out if you can with the paint, which one. And then also if you know of how to repair the slates and the wooden things. So I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye guys.